Hey folks, today I'm going to be installing the 2 terabyte Samsung 980 Pro NVMe drive into this motherboard here. And this is a PCI Express 4.0 drive. And this slot is actually Gen 5, but it's absolutely fine because they are backwards compatible. So the drive itself being Gen 4 will still work here, but of course it will only get Gen 4 max speeds. So in order to install this, I first of all need to remove the heatsink. If your motherboard does not come with its own heatsink, then it is definitely worthwhile making sure you add your own as these drives do get exceedingly warm. And here is the NVMe drive itself, which you can see is very small. Before I install this, I just need to remove this protective piece of plastic here. And then we pop this in at a slight angle. Okay, until that's nicely clicked into place. And then you'll see it doesn't quite rest on its own. It will want to lift back up again. That's absolutely fine. If your motherboard requires this to be screwed down, then your motherboard should include the screw to do so. The actual 980 Pro does not include the M.2 screw. In my case, in order to lock this into place, there is this little grey latch here, which just needs to be turned. And likewise, just before replacing the heatsink here, it is important to remember to remove the plastic film. And then it's just important to carefully line up these screws here. As if you misalign them and have to remove this heatsink, there will be some resistance because of the thermal pad. You don't want to over tighten these screws. There just needs to be good contact with the thermal pad and the NVMe drive. And that's it. Installation is completed. I can get this motherboard set up into my case and enjoy the super fast 2TB 980 Pro.